So I'm short-staffed at the moment. Gabe tells me you've worked at a restaurant before. A couple years' experience as a server? Uh... Yeah, <laughs> come clean. Gabe's full of shit. I've never worked in a restaurant before. Never stops that one. Yep. But I would love the work, if experience isn't an issue. Want to give it a try? It's not too busy right now, and we keep it informal around here. Okay. Thanks. All right. <laughs> so we have a few folks that need checking on. Ducky and Diane over there. Okay. Steph over here. There's a table in the back that needs clearing also. You can give the food orders to me, and I'll handle anyone here at the bar. All right? All right. Got it. I've never... It's really nice to have you here, Alex. Thanks. I've never done food service as well, so... Guess I'm a server now. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. Okay. Can I get you two anything? Miss Chen, here at last to relieve our suspense. Hi. I am Reginald McAllister, the third, <laughs> ducky to friends, former entrepreneur, now retired, and this young woman is Diane. Hey there. Nice to meet you. <laughs> I didn't realize that... Uh, that we all knew you were coming? Yes. Gabe is generous with uh, both friendship and information. You're from Portland, right? I moved here from D.C. six months ago. How are you finding the small town thing? Kind of bizarre. I've been here one day, and I've already hit my hug quota for the year. <laughs> <laughs> She's funny. Uh... Diane is a geologist, recently working as a process manager for Typhon Mining. I'm glad there's another newbie around here, too. Can I get you anything? Oh, yeah, we're super hungry. I'd love a pie special with fries. Cheeseburger with mushrooms, and my usual to drink. Jed will know what to do. All right, I'll go put that order in. Thanks. Do I have to remember that question? Speak. Hey, Jed. Yeah? I've got an order from Ducky and Diane. Go ahead. Oh, of course, I have to remember exactly. Burger with mushrooms. One burger with mushrooms. Uh-huh, and? Uh... Hi, special... Oh, fuck me. What the... Clean... This is why... Fuck. Yeah, whatever. Pie special with fries. One pie special with fries. Ducky asked for his usual? Yes. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he's fond of a particular rye whiskey. I keep a personal bottle for him. Oh, that's odd. I don't see it. Oh, now wait. I bet Ducky took that bottle upstairs last night. Yeah, he and Gabe went on carousing long after closing. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Serves him right, if you ask me. But feel free to go upstairs and look for it. I'm sure he'd be grateful. Okay. Oh, if you can't find it, Deputy oh, Pike was with them. Yeah. Might have some idea. I'm really tired of frickin' bots so badly. Okay, the audio just stopped. There must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. Typhon's not a bad company once you get used to how they operate. Right. Yeah, that's what people keep... Hey. Alex, right? I'm Steph. Hey. Just seeing if you need food or anything. Oh no, I'm good. Thanks though. Sorry I couldn't hang out at the record store. I've got some time now though if you want to chat. Re 
you sitting with? So are you um, here with somebody? Or... That's Ryan's stuff. Apparently he ditched me for Gabe. They went to get first aid. <laughs> Being a hero again. Ryan's always doing that. <laughs> it's a Luke and family thing. Have you heard about Jed's rescue? It was a big deal. Back when he was a minor, he saved- I can't imagine. Alex wants an earload of Haven <laughs> trivia just now. Sorry, Jed. I can't imagine. He doesn't like to brag, but there's stuff about it all over the place if you look. Interesting. Is that your shot? Is that your shot? What is that? This is bedazzled kiwi schnapps. No one's ever ordered it, so Gabe's trying to get rid of it with the jukebox game. What's a jukebox game? It's like a short version of 20 questions where you're trying to guess a song, guess wrong, you have to take the shot. <laughs> Ryan and I are going to play. You want to take his place? You're on. Dude, you're on. <laughs> yes. I can't wait for the copyright music. So, I'll pick a song. You have five yes or no questions before you have to guess it. Okay. Got one. Jukebox is all yours. So, what do you want to ask me? Hmm. I should flip through these and see what might be good to ask. Uh, cover our question. Is there... People on the cover. Are there people on the cover? No. Okay. Yeah, no. No, oh, personal question. When, why do you like it? Why do you like this song? So, I guess we're breaking the yes or no questions only rule. Can you handle it? So, why do I like this song? The lyrics crack me up. Even the title's pretty goofy. Reminds me of fun times, I guess. Goofy title, you say? Hmm. Uh, curse word? So, does the song title have a curse word in it? <laughs> a curse word? Would that offend you? Answer the question. <laughs> no curse words in the title, ma'am. You've got two questions left. Has a symbol? Does the band name have a symbol in it? Like something that's not just a letter? Oh. Yeah, it totally does. Nice. Last question. Yeah, uh, all right, I know. A uh, picture of an animal? Is there an animal on the cover art? Uh, no, no animals. Ugh, too bad. Some of these are really cute. I know, right? That's your five. Ready to guess? Yeah. Let me look through one last time. Here's what I know. The band name does have a symbol in it. No curse words in the song title. No animals on the cover. No people on the cover. The title's kind of goofy. Think that's enough to figure it out? We'll see. Is it that one? No, it's not. Sorry. All right. Glitter drink me. It's not as bad as it looks. <laughs> How was it? Fantastic. It's actually delicious. <laughs> you should try one. <laughs> hey, thanks for playing. I'm really glad we did. Me too. What are you working on? Is that record store inventory? <laughs> no, it's character stats. Do you know what a LARP is? 
remind me. I've heard the term before. Live action role play. It's like a tabletop role playing game, but acted out in real life. Costumes, foam weapons, beanbag spells. It's great. Gabe was talking about a LARP with Ethan. Yeah, it's next week. They're coming with me. It's their first time. I'm so excited. <laughs> nice. Would you ever want to join us sometime? Give it a try. Sure, I'd try it. If you and Gabe both like it, it must be super fun. Awesome. I should get back to work. Okay. There must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. I got written up for leaving my phone. Starting over from this scratch like this? But I guess it started fucking terrifying is what it is. You're telling me. Haven is nice. Just wish it felt like home. Hope we both get there soon. Love Maine, but... Okay. Shit. Now Mac's scared. At least he's not freaking out anymore. He won't make me lose control. Idiot. You're gonna lose her. You're gonna lose her and it's all your fault. At least he's right about something. Can I speak to him? Wow. I messed Mac up pretty good. Arcanoid. G-A-B. That's gotta be Gabe, right? I wonder what this is. Can I... Oh, I can't even do the racing one. Uh... Oh, it's... Okay, it's this game. This is much more reliable than the tourist one. Uh, whoops, that's my bad. Okay, I was used to the diagonal launches, but whatever.
All right, let's see if I can find Ducky's whiskey up here. Good old whiskey. This all looks really fancy, but no rye whiskey. That sucks. Search the couch. Why not? Ha! Was it really? It was seriously in between the couch cushions. What do you know? That's pretty ridiculous. Found this upstairs. In Gabe's couch? Really? Really? Must have been a night. Many thanks, Alex. My pleasure. Put in a good word. <laughs> well, it's my first day working here, so put in a good word for me, okay? <laughs> She's a go-getter. Can I pour you a glass? Uh, no, no. Allow me. Okay. To Miss Alex Chen, a most tenacious detective. To Alex. Cheers. Okay. Oh. <sighs> He's just like, yeah. <laughs> I just hope I got the order right, because that'll be sucking if I didn't. Miss Chen? My dad was in the service. And... Glad you could fill in today. What am I doing next? Clear the table in the back. I was like, I was going, I was over there and I'm like, what table is it referring to? Oh, this bottle one, okay. Holy shit. Can I talk to you real quick? What do you want? What do you want? Listen, what happened upstairs was fucked up, right? From both of us. What's your point? Where are you going with this? Look, Riley's headed over here. She's pretty heated. I, I, I don't think it helps to recap all the gory details, you know? <laughs> You're awful. You really are a piece of shit. Look, she's gonna break up with me otherwise. We've been together four years. She is the best thing that's ever happened to me. Yeah, and it's your own fault. So please, help me out. I, I don't know, man. Shit. Guess what? What the You're fuck the one is wrong with you? Exactly. Oh my god. Look at your face. No, it's okay. Don't even. What were you thinking? He wasn't. Where's Gabe? Why do you give a shit? Because you beat because him up. Because my boyfriend just got into a fight with him. Exactly. I swear. This is it. You better have a good explanation or we're done. He doesn't have an explanation. No, it's, it's not my fault. I just wanted to talk to the guy. Oh, no, yeah. What? About you. Oh, About yeah. <laughs> why you guys are meeting behind my back. Okay. So how did the fight happen? The bastard sucker punched me. No, he didn't. I did. Okay. Um, not exactly sucker punched, but he definitely started it. No, he didn't. Oh, God. Were you there, too? Yep. I uh, now call out bullshit. I'm calling out bullshit. Yeah, I was there. Max telling you a whole lot of bullshit. <laughs> like, literally. You know what? That doesn't even surprise me anymore. Yeah. So what really happened? I beat his ass. Mac barged in, 
accused Gabe of sleeping with you, sucker punched him, and then kicked him while he was down. Riley, listen. What happened to Mac's face? I did it. I did that. Yep. Oh, good. It sounds like he deserved it. Yep. Thanks for telling me the truth, Alex. Yep. Wait. Wait, are you... Are we okay? No. Are you fucking serious? I'm so embarrassed by you right now. Why would you be okay when you just blatantly lied that you just beat up a fucking guy just because you were questioning the whole time? But are we oh, still together? Yeah. What do you think, you fucking idiot? Puzzle Crawler, thank you no. for the follow. How are you doing this evening? Alex Chen? Uh... Assaulting Mac Loudon on your first day here, huh? Yeah, he had it coming. I'm Jason Pike, the deputy sheriff. I'm gonna have to take you in for questioning. All right. Am I under arrest? Are you saying I'm under arrest? <laughs> your face. <laughs> you should see your face. Oh, jeez. <laughs> no, I'm only kidding. No, nobody's in trouble here. I, <laughs> Gabe and I just like to prank each other. Uh, just want to make sure. <laughs> I've never been pranked by a cop before. <laughs> you definitely got me. Yep. Thanks for being a good sport. Can I buy you a drink? Um, maybe I'm working right now. Well, I'll be at the bar. You want one, you just come by, okay? I'm glad he has a sense of humor. <laughs> That's why I'm like, am I under arrest when you say that questioning BS? Uh, literally, thank God. He was a nice guy. It's like, oh, I'm just kidding, man. Chill. <laughs> I think that's it. Uh, let Jed know tasks are done. Okay. Man, that was a chill dude for sure. Curious if I can read him. Yes, I can. Damn, was that prank out of line? Did I come on too strong? It was bold. I'll give you that. Uh, can I speak to him? Hey, Alex. Ready? Ready for that drink? I'm ready to take you up on that drink. All right. Wait, hey, Jed, can we get, uh... Thanks. And keep it quick. She's on the clock. <laughs> drink of what, though, is the question. <sighs> you know, your brother's been talking about you getting here for months. I'm starting to get the sense. I even remember exactly the day he found your number. He was telling everybody in this place. Really? Yeah. Pretty heartwarming stuff. Well, I've got to get back to work. <laughs> Later, Alex. Well, it was a small detail and then done. And done. Are you finished up with everything you want to do? Yep. Yeah, I took care of everything you mentioned. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? Nah, the boys should be back soon. And here we are. Well, speak of the devil. How you feeling? Not great. Not awful. I got Alex covering for you. For real? We need to talk. I'll be on the rooftop, okay? Yep. Okay. I think that's enough for today. Uh, let's see if I got the answer. I was glad to have you. I can see you're a hard worker. Not to mention, you can sure hold your liquor. <laughs> you can't keep an injured. You can't keep an injured man waiting. You better go upstairs. Thanks. What was that? We'll voice see you tomorrow. Line? Okay. Time to talk to Gabe. I guess the food wasn't necessary to fulfill completely it was just hey whether you get it right or not there's no consequence apparently literally i can only think that must be an achievement on, on uh consoles to be like oh yeah you get the order right and everything but i don't know Why'd you punch me? 
Oh, you know, just to got an ability that converts my emotions to someone else's emotions. How's your jaw? How's your jaw? Is the pain bad? Look, Gabe, I'm really sorry. I... Here's a drink. How much alcohol do I need? <laughs> Been just having non-stop alcohol this entire evening, or late afternoon. What? I. Hidden cooler. <laughs> Do you have a cooler under there? I like to hide beers around the house. Cause, well, you never know. You never know what. <laughs> you just never know. So, need a manager for your underground cage fighting career? Gabe, okay, I'm really sorry. How many bones have you broken? Like, on other people? Dude, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Don't apologize. I'm fine. Now that we're talking about it. Guess I never realized. That uh, I can kick your ass. <laughs> oh, I'm so doing that. That I can kick your ass? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> no, I never realized what your life must have been like. On your own. It was fine. You know, when I pulled you off the Mac and you hit me, I, I was angry. Then I thought about how you took him apart. Like you've done it before. Ah, no, that was just the, the fucking anger. That was all, I fought a lot. Didn't you go to Juvie? <laughs> Didn't you go to Juvie? Isn't that, like, prison? Yeah. That was the hardest time of my life. Some days of that. I didn't think I'd make it out. Uh. But I get the feeling you've been through worse. I can tell there's something going on with you. Something troubling you. Maybe it's time you open up. I want to talk to Gabe, but what can I even say right now to explain what happened with Mac? Tell him about your past. Tell him about your power. Might as well just do the past. Like, literally. Yeah, confirm choice for now. No reason to tell about the power yet. Growing up in the system was hell. In my first foster home, an older boy followed me into the bathroom. So I pushed him out. He got angry. So did I. Then I broke his nose. I was 14. In the second home, one of the other kids committed suicide. And I couldn't eat for a month. Yeah, because all she felt was depressed. After a couple of weeks in the fifth home, I got so depressed that my new parents sent me to a hospital. I never saw him again. The hurt follows me everywhere. It's the other kids get adopted, leave the system. Not me. 
They never picked me. I'm broken. <laughs> Do you really believe that? Uh, today I do, wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? After all this time, it's hard not to take it personally. And it just keeps happening. It never stops. And I look at you. You've got a home, a job, a girlfriend. Got it all figured out. Yep. And I don't. Okay. Is that for me? Is that for me? It is now. Okay. Little cat. What is this? A reminder. Looks like a match to me. <laughs> that was the last matchbook I got when I was still in juvie. Did some pretty unsavory stuff to score it. And you still have it? Yeah. I carry it with me everywhere. When I got out, I went through the last few matches real quick. Obviously, but... I, I could never bring myself to use the last one. It reminded me how bad life got. And how much better I was going to make it. Uh -huh. I can't take this. Thank you. Whatever. I don't know what to say. You're welcome. Don't give up. Why would he need it? He's got a family all set. When I found Haven and Charlotte, I couldn't believe they were real. Everything before was such hell. Now it's different. You can do the same. Start a new life. I just question if um, Ethan is his kid, or if she just, pre or if Charlotte just previously had, like the kid before and whatnot. That situation. You made it out of the system, Alex. You survived. It's time to move on. Uh, it's not that simple. It's not that simple. I've made so many mistakes. We all have. Survival isn't a neat and tidy process. But it's way better than the alternative. And don't forget. I'm here to help you. That's not going to change. Yay, brother. I'm honestly surprised that they didn't want to make this game so that it could have been a boy or a girl as the main character. They just, by default, did a girl. Because they, honestly, the way the game is written, they could have easily had done, hey, choose whichever gender and whatnot they could have easily had done that because alex is just a random person that just is, was in the system her entire life so they could have easily had written her that way i'm just surprised that they didn't because it's like it would have been great so, to have two guys when were you gonna tell me about the guitar oh shit you found it it was supposed to be a huge surprise Surprise? <laughs> <laughs> well, what do you think? I love it. I love it. Thank you so much. Of course. 
Welcome home. Oh, hey, dude. What's up? Hey. Is Ethan up here? No. He was heading home. He was, but... I haven't seen him in a while. Oh, lovely. He went up... the mountain. Or cave. You don't think... Mine. Maybe? Fuck, maybe he did. What is it? I think he went up to the mountains. If he actually did, we need to move. Now. Yeah. Let's go. He literally decided to do it anyway. That's for sure. <laughs>